Let's talk about Florida. How many days left to Florida? 28 days. It's getting closer and closer. Yeah. So when we're in Florida and we're at the parks, you know that sometimes the rides break down, right? Right. Try what, to be patient. Yeah. What are we going to do if we're on a ride? Let's see. Let's say we're on what ride? The Imagination Ride. Okay, yeah, because that's broke down on us, right? If we're on Figment and the ride breaks down, what are you going to do? Just get out of here. Well, you have to wait until they tell us we wait. can. So what we have to do is sit in the ride vehicle and do whatever they tell us to do. Right. Until they either tell us we can get off or the ride starts. Right. So how are you going to keep from getting upset? Watch my cell phone. Yeah, that's a very good idea. You have your cell phone you can watch. Right. Just do things to keep yourself busy. Right. What else can you do? Eat snacks. And tell yourself it's going to be okay. Yes. We're going to get off the ride, right? Yep. We're not going to be stuck on there forever. Right. So there's nothing to get upset about, right? Right. right. What if we rode Test Track and we got no, stuck in line? No, not that. Anything uh, but uh, that. Okay, okay. Anything. Okay, okay. We will Please, we, anything but Test Track. Okay, we will not try Test Track. But what if you want to ride Hagrid's? That's a ride you really like, right? Yes. And what if you get stuck on that ride? I don't know. You just have to wait, right? Right. You have to be patient because you don't right. want to say I'm never going to ride Hagrid's again just because the ride breaks down when you're on it. Right. You like that ride. Yes. Okay, so you have to think of some ways you can cope with it. And you have to remember there's always a possibility the ride will break down, right? Right. So what will you tell yourself if that it's happens? It's going to be okay, yada, yada, yada. <laughs> and you're not going to yell, right? Right. Because you might be riding it with Stephanie, right? Right. So you don't want to yell and then scare Stephanie or something, right? No. Yeah, so you just got to try to remain under control and try to be calm. Okay. All right? Right. We just need to talk about this before the trip so that you'll be prepared if that happens, right? Right. Okay. This is a question from one of our viewers. Craig, do you like planes, like airplanes? Why, yes. Yes, I do. Do you it like... Took... Oh, go ahead. He took me fine state to state. Yeah, you like traveling on them, right? Mm -hmm. Do you like to watch them? Yep. Mm -hmm. What's your favorite thing about airplanes? The Southern Airlines. Yeah, you like plane to... snacks. Plane snacks. <laughs> it's very true. And we usually fly southwest, right? Yep. Yeah. Our next question is what is your favorite movie? Why, Space Jam A New Legacy. You know how they. The Looney Tunes play basketball again? Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's not really a bad movie. Yeah, I thought it was a good movie. I saw yep. it with you. Yep. Our next question is, who is your favorite Disney character? Why the emotions of inside out? Joy, sadness, anger, disgust, and fear. Those are your favorites? Yep. Do you have, is one of them your favorite more than the other? Yeah, joy. Joy. Yep. You like joy. <sighs> yep. You like to be happy? Yep. And you like happy people, right? Mm -hmm. Okay, now start. Good day, everybody. And today we're making pretzel bites. Need some ingredients. Kosher salt, cinnamon sugar, two cans of biscuits, and butter. There. Can you open the biscuits for me? Did they open up? Oh, good job. You got them open. Okay, so take those biscuits out of there. Ugh. Okay, now you can separate the biscuits. You're doing now? I'm rolling them. You roll them. Yep. Just like that, right? Yep. Yeah. Wet, folks. He rolled them. He's going to cut them into about three pieces. If you had bigger biscuits than we do, you might do four pieces, but... <sighs> I tried four, there and you know. it just made the pieces too Look, small. Look, up in the sky, it's a bird, it's a plane, it's a flying badger, it's a woodpecker. 
And now here's something you really like. Okay, what are you gonna do now? Drop, drop them. Yep, drop them into the boiling water. Oops, there's water everywhere. It's okay. Do it okay? All right, scoop them out and put them on the tray. Good job, Craig. Okay, now what, Craig? Now we brush them. Brushing. Listen, Craig is I brushing like, them with you, melted butter. You know my thing. My thing. And we'll also brush them with more butter yeah, after they're good. done. But we're going to do a couple of different kinds. The one in the back, Craig will sprinkle some cinnamon and sugar on. Okay. Okay, go ahead. Whoa, okay. <laughs> Let's try the other oh. side. We're just gonna have a lot of cinnamon sugar, you know. Can you really have too much? Okay, okay, that's probably good. It's in the front, Craig is going to sprinkle some salt Let's on. Get it. Not too much, well, it depends on how much you like. I don't like a ton on mine. Okay, that's probably enough on those, Craig. All right, and this is what we have. And now we put them in an oven preheated to 425. And bake them for 12 to 15 minutes. Okay. Okay, Craig's gonna try the finished product. Here's the cinnamon ones. Here's the regular. I'm not sure we did it all right. <laughs> Some of them were kind of soggy. What do you think, Craig? Mmm. Mm. Tastes good, Mom. Yeah, they were easy. Do they taste like Aunt Annie's pretzels? No, not to me. But, hey. It was easy, and it was fun to do, and Craig likes them, so that's all hey, that matters. Craig, how was your day today? It was fun. You and me made pretzel bites when you went to the ear piercing. Yeah, I went and got my ears pierced today. Yep. Right? And then we made pretzel bites this afternoon. Yep. I taste the cinnamon ones. Yeah. They didn't turn out so great. Right. Maybe we'll find a different recipe for that. Right. We still had fun making them, didn't we? Yep, yep, you did, yep. You did a really good job. Yep. Tomorrow's Craig and Stuff Day. Uh-huh. It happens every Sunday. Are you excited about it? Yep, I'm excited about it. And today's episode is brought to you by Pretzel Bites. They taste good. And this is Craig A. Bever saying, see you next time.